Okay, welcome back to GNS YouTube. Uh, today we're going to be talking about the Danese Sieta jacket. I'm just going to run through some of the features on it for you. Okay, comes in a couple of colours. Uh, this is the black one on the table, as you can see, and I'm wearing the blue and white one. Uh, some of the nice features on this jacket is the fact that it, even though it's waterproof, it's got the Danese D-Dry liner, which I'll show you right there. That's the D-Dry liner there. Okay, so that's your waterproof liner. It's fixed into the jacket. It's a lightweight jacket. Okay, it's not a heavy, bulky jacket. It doesn't have a thermal liner. So, great for um, warmer weather. But, if you get caught out in the rain, you don't need to, to worry about it. It's category uh, CE2, okay, so category 2 CE approved. Um, simple zip fastening with poppers and then Velcro at the top and just on the chest there as well, just to seal the jacket up. Got a couple of pockets here on the front, some adjusters on the waist to pull the waist in. The body armour is in the elbow and forearm and it's that long as well, it comes right down the forearm, fits very, very comfortably, and also in the shoulders, okay, you've got shoulder armour in there as well. If you just open the jacket back up, you can see there is a zipped pocket there, allowing you to put a back protector in. It doesn't come with a back protector as standard, but that's pretty usual with all these jackets, uh, but you can fit one in. If you do have the matching Danese trousers, or any Danese trousers, you can zip it in with the um, full zip that's at the bottom of the jacket there. As I said before, it is a shorter style jacket, it's very lightweight, it's very, very comfortable to wear. With that waterproof liner, it makes it a pretty good all-rounder. That's the Danese Seattle jacket.